Hey guys, listen up. If you Googled or YouTube the Respire electronic bike or any electronic bike for that matter, you're in the right spot. Throughout this video, if there is anything that I forget to mention or leave out in this review, hit me up in the comments. I kid you not, I will reply to every single last one of you. I was shopping for an electronic bike. Like many of you, I didn't know where to start. So I went on Amazon, looked at bikes, looked at prices, then I ran into a, a wall. I wanted a bike, a brand that I can trust, a brand who's been cranking out electronic bikes since, I don't know, the 1900s. All I knew were popular brands like BMX, Mongoose, other leading brands, which that brought me here. And I got this bike and I'm doing this review for you so you can better make your decision. My name is PhD candidate Tracy Walker. I'm registered in X-ray, CAT scan, MRI. I am your radiology liaison. If you have any questions about ultrasound, nuclear medicine, mammography, MRI, CAT scan, x-ray, how much those pay, what it takes to get there, they are all two-year programs and they pay more than all bachelor's degrees. Some of them pay more than master's degrees. If you have any questions about that, hit me up in the comments, I kid you not. I got your back on that too. Without further ado, we're going to jump right into this video. All right, and welcome back. First, I want to start by saying that due to big greed, essentially everyone on the planet has taken a few thousand dollar pay cut because of the gas prices. I was looking for an alternative to combat and offset those prices of the greedy. And here we are. First, I'm going to go over a few of the futures and one of the surprises that I didn't know about. And then second, I'll talk about the setbacks we've encountered, uh, installation, And also, the bike comes probably 80% put together when it arrives. We're going to take a little ride. This is how you turn it on. Ooh, since I'm here now, I want to talk about... You can't put the speed in miles per an hour it's always in kilometers so we'll always have to convert perhaps someone in the comments can help me, help me with that but as of so far i have not figured out a way to put it in miles per an hour all right you turn on the back right here you hold this down for two seconds this is the battery pack you charge this guy through here So first, there is an assist where you pedal and it just helps you go up the hill. And then second, there is a mode where it's just all electronic. And I believe this bike goes 25 miles an hour. It's really neat. I believe there's five levels to assist. 
let's see. Yes. This bike is crazy fast. This will get you uphills all day. The battery lasts really well. We're going a few days, probably about an hour a day for the past like week we've been driving it. Yes, this is great. Hey, sir. Just chilling, making videos. Yeah. Right here is the trigger to just go all electric. Woo. And now, as you can see, I'm not pedaling. Going 27 kilometers per an hour, 30 kilometers per an hour. Yes. Now we're slowing it down. So that just happened. All right, and there you have it. What you guys just witnessed is the frame coming off the back tire while I was riding it. Thank God nothing happened. Nonetheless, I am a perfect physical specimen, so if I were to have a collision with myself, I'd be all right. All jokes aside, overall, I think the bike is a good bike. Um, when we got the bike, it came mostly intact put together all we had to do was put on the front tire adjust the seat and we were ready to go we actually bought our own seat and put that on there it did come with a lot of zip ties to um to restrain the uh the loose wires and cords that were popping out that were like you know exposed um, but we found ourselves in Amazon store again, buying more zip ties to cover uh, additional, uh, to bound loose, more loose wires to the bike so we wouldn't trip up on that. Also, we used it for the, uh, the front light and some more wires in the front as well. Um, this is my first time riding a bike with a big fat tire which is really neat it's cool however the the tire has more surface area therefore it's going to pick up more debris along the way so on our second day driving it um we picked up a sticker bug i don't know what you guys call them but in texas we call them the we call them sticker bugs and it deflated the tire so we had to wait for a ride to come and get us and take the bike back home, took it to a bike, bike store and they reinflated it and we were back to normal. So we probably ridden the bike maybe five days total. We had the bike for two weeks. The bike cost about, I think it was $1,700 on Amazon and the bike broke up, broke on us and I can't seem to get the tire back on the axle is that what you call it i can't get the frame back on the tire i can get one side engaged but not the other and once i get the other side engaged the other side is not on and i've spent hours and hours trying to put the tire back on so i just took the tire off and we're going to take it to a shop and see if they can um get it right for us hit me up uh if you want to know any updates on the bike if we returned it uh, what happened was we initiated the return on Amazon and I'm very proud to say this but the company itself reached out to us to address the broken bike and um, they want to see what they can do to help us fix it they want to know the error code that displayed on the screen um, you know they're gonna come out of pocket to uh, you know fix the bike if it costs any money and personally we're not like that we're probably just gonna you know pay on on our own 
but perhaps when more videos on this bike comes out and other people have problems then we'll see if the bike is good or not but thanks for watching my video if you guys want to hang out with me outside of youtube uh, i play a game called dead by daylight on psn uh, it is cross play enabled um my gamer tag is hard body tough capital h capital b capital t uh, I'm also into fitness. Um, if you want to be fit like me, I have a lot of fitness videos that I do. Um, I share, you know, ways to, you know, eat better and uh, motivation. And I have routines that I do daily to, you know, basically stay fit. But all right, guys, it's a wrap. Anything I didn't address in this video that you want to know, hit me up in the comments. I kid you not, I will reply to you. All right. Peace. Bye.